What's up guys? We're here today. We're gonna, we're gonna be talking about hypertrophy, what it is, the key components, and if it's right for you. So let's go get started. So what is hypertrophy? Is it a sugar rush? Is it when you get hyper? No. It's and the, the actual term for it is the growth and increase in size of the cells of your muscles. So with that said, let's jump over to the next point. So the next point is uh, Andy. So um, compared to actual growth, what is hypertrophy itself and what's the difference between hypertrophy and regular lifting? Well, in terms of our terms, regular lifting is, could be anything like uh, four sets of 10, three sets of 12, three sets of 15, pretty much the stuff that we all started with. Um, hypertrophy takes it in a little bit of a different approach. Hypertrophy, more or less, we incorporate things like tempo, we incorporate things like uh, supersets, drop sets, everything you've seen, but in order to do it the right way, we're gonna, it takes a little bit more work, and we're gonna talk about that next. So the key components of hypertrophy, it's so hard to say, hypertrophy. Uh, time under tension, what is time under tension? Time under tension is, refers to how long uh, your muscles are under strain for during an exercise. And this is, this is key and, and, and really important because it couples with tempo. Uh, you can only get time under tension when you have a very set, slow, and slow-paced type of tempo. So if you've ever seen in workouts, I don't know if those of you that go to bodybuilding.com, there's a 2-1, uh, 2-1. Basically, that just means how slow you're going to be coming down for the eccentric movement and the contraction, which is pressing up for a bench press, for example, which is the 1. So a 2 for the slow down and then 1 for the press. So with those two coupled together, you can generate volume, right? We want to have a high amount of reps per exercise in this case, because volume can pertain to so many things like uh, reps times sets times the exercise times the week, but we'll get into that later. But main key components are time under tension, uh, volume, and tempo. Those are the things that are gonna help ensure your muscle growth through hypertrophy. All right guys, that's the video. Uh, today we talked a little bit about hypertrophy, tempo, time and retention, and why it may or may not work for you. Um, this is the introduction to a playlist that we'll be uploading very soon. We hope you guys stick around. We're gonna actually be showing you guys a couple of methods in order to get hypertrophy correctly. A lot of people in the gym kind of just come in there and kind of throw in three sets of 10, four sets of 10, and you don't really get hypertrophy from there. And hypertrophy just isn't about making it three sets of 15 or four sets of 15 as we've seen before. Um, we're gonna be running through, through it with you guys. We're probably gonna give you a lot of methods and a lot of techniques, so stick around. Uh, remember to comment, like, share, and subscribe, and we will see you guys very soon.